Yo, it's your boy the Android Doctor back again with another tutorial video. Okay, in this video I'll be showing you how to restore your Samsung Galaxy S6 back to Android 7.0 using Samsung Smart Switch. You might have tried flashing the stock firmware using Odin and it didn't work. So I'm going to show you how to do it using Smart Switch. It's going to be quite a lengthy process, so please bear that in mind. But once we've finished you should have android 7.0 back onto your phone so um at the moment i'm running a custom rom which is android 8.0 let me just show you all okay so android 8.0 and i want to put the original stock firmware back onto the phone so um i'm just going to show you how to do it right now so first things first, head on over to the link in the description down below and it's going to take you to where you can download Smart Switch from. And you'll see this option here, download for PC. Just click on it and it will download the Smart Switch. So I've already downloaded it. Here it is on my desktop. So let's just launch it. Okay, so when you click on it to launch it, you might get this error. The application has failed to start because it's side by side configuration is incorrect. So I'm going to show you how to solve that. Okay, so to solve the error, just head on to the link in the description down below. It's going to take you to this page here, this Microsoft page, and just scroll down. Uh, this link here VC uh, 2008 SP1 this is the service pack one from 2008 and just go ahead and click download and it's going to start downloading Okay, so once it's finished downloading, just open it, select yes, and just go through the installation process. Tick the box I have read and accept the license terms, hit install. Okay, so once it's successfully installed, hit finish and then go back to Smart Switch and try launch it. Hit yes and it should now then launch. Okay, so now just go ahead and Tick these two boxes, I accept. Go ahead and hit finish. Okay. So next, just connect your phone to the USB cable. Let's just do that real quick. Okay, so connect it to the USB cable. Then go ahead and select the more option here and select emergency software recovery and initialization. Then 
and select device initial oh, I can't even pronounce it initialization okay so type in your model number in my case it's the SM G920 F and then go ahead and hit search okay so what you need to do now is you need to enter the SN number the SN number can be found here on the back of your phone down here at the bottom so just go ahead and enter that SN number just write it down on a piece of paper or something and then just go ahead and enter it into there okay so I'm going to enter mine so Okay, so once you enter it, just go ahead and hit OK. Then hit OK again. Then go ahead and hit OK. And now it's going to prepare the software update and initial. I can't even pronounce it. Oh, it's bad. Initialization for Galaxy S6. Please do not disconnect the cable from the PC. So just keep it connected. Now go ahead and hit yes. Okay, so now you need to follow these instructions. So make sure the device is turned off. So you can unplug it. And then just power it off. And then number two, switch the device to recovery mode and reconnect the cable. To switch to recovery mode, turn on the device by pressing the power button while holding down the volume, down button, and the home button. Okay, so let's just can do that real quick. Okay, so you need to press the volume down button here on the side, along with the home button here, and the power button. So press all three, volume down, home button, and the power button. Okay, so now just press the volume up button to continue. And now reconnect the phone to the USB cable. Just like that. And then select OK. And now it's preparing the components for the S6 software update and initial <laughs> oh, I can't even pronounce it anyway however it's downloading the firmware now and it started at 1% so we're just going to wait for that to get to 100% and I'll be back with you to continue the rest of the restore okay so the download is now complete So it's just going through the software update and initialization for the S6. Um, it's at 0% there. We're just waiting for it to get to 100. And then the phone should then reboot. Okay, so this part shouldn't really take too long. So 
can see the percentage is moving pretty quickly. Okay, we're almost done now. We're at 91%. And we're done. Okay, so the phone has now rebooted. And we've got that little message there, software update and initialization for Galaxy S6 is complete. The device will now restart, disconnect and reconnect the cable. I'm not going to disconnect it right now. I'm just going to wait for it to finish erasing. It's just doing a factory reset there. Once again, it's going to reboot. Okay, so just go ahead and hit OK. And now you can unplug the phone and just wait for it to boot up. Okay, so let's just um, go back through the whole setup there. Sign into my Wi Fi. to the terms and what's good about this smart switch as well it downloads the latest version of um, Android for your device so um, your phone will be up to date you won't need to check for any software updates it will have the latest update on your phone okay so we're just checking for the network this may take a minute or two
Okay, so the whole process is finished and it roughly took about 25 to 30 minutes to do. Um, I did skip a lot of it out in the video just to make the video that bit shorter. But let's just check. So we're back on the stock firmware. This is the latest version for this device, which is Android 7.0. And like I said, if you check for any updates, there won't be any because this is the latest update for the phone because smart smart switch like i says it searches for the latest update and it will install it so yeah this was just a well not really a quick video this was just my um tutorial showing you how to restore your samsung galaxy s6 or samsung galaxy s6 edge back to its original stock firmware if you was running a custom rom and if you had root um so yeah, if this video helped you out, you already know what to do. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you get stuck with anything, leave any comments in the comment section down below asking for help. And I'll try my best to reply as quick as I can. And feel free to share the video um, so it too can help other people. Thanks for watching. It's your boy, the Android Doctor, and I'm out. Deuces.